Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can install Visual Studio Code on our Windows 11 or Windows 10 machine and how we can create our first project. So go to this URL. I'll have this link in the description below. And then click on this button here. It will download the installer for you. So it download has just started in my case. If it is not downloaded, just click on this link and your download will start. Once the download is complete, just click on open file. Click on I accept. Click next. And this is where your Microsoft Visual Studio Code will be installed. Click Next. Click Next and check these two. And if you want to add Visual Studio Code desktop icon, you can just check this two. Or you can keep this unchecked, does not matter. I just keep this checked for now. Click on Next. Click Install. And now your Visual Studio Code installation has started. Let's wait till this installation is complete. Now click on Launch Visual Studio Code. Keep this checked and Visual Studio Code will open. Click on Finish. And as you can see, our Visual Studio Code has opened. Let's maximize this and these are the themes that we can choose by default. I'll just have this dark mode selected. Now let's create our first project. So what you can do is you can close this Welcome tab and you will see this. You can click on File and click on New Folder or Open Folder here, sorry. Now you can go wherever you want and create a new folder. Let's call it my first project and click select folder. And now this folder has opened. You can click on I trust the authors. Now this folder has opened. Again, I'll close this. And now what you can do is you can create files inside this by just clicking this icon and let's call it dex.html. And you can write some HTML code here. So yeah. And now you can again create some other file if you want to code in Python or PHP. You can just create main dot, let's call it main dot py for Python. And I can write some Python code here, right? If you are on PHP, you can uh, create a PHP file and call it main dot PHP or index dot PHP or whatever. And this is how you can create files. Now to run Python or PHP, you will have to install Python or PHP or any other language in your computer and then click here and install the extension for that language. So as you can see, I have this in popular Python. So this is just Python support in Visual Studio Code. It's not actually the interpreter. So what you need to do is you need to install the interpreter or compiler for that language and then install the extension for that particular language. So if you want to check out how you can do it for Python or various other languages, check the playlist in the description below. And yeah. This is how you can install and create projects in Visual Studio Code in Windows 10 or Windows 11. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.